Hi, I just woke up. It's like 12.30 and we're gonna spend the day together. I want, I want to do a lot today, but I don't want to do it by myself, which is why you're here. Um, I have 30 minutes to get ready. Why do I sound so congested, huh? Let me know. Hold on, Buka. Hey, y'all. Welcome to my spend the day with me. Highly uh, missed and requested spend the day with me. I hope you enjoy it. Bye. And we're back with the Kelsey show. Hi, hi. Um, how about I just grab my thingy? Huh? That makes sense. I'm gonna prop you up because obviously this is not working. I'm gonna put the back camera too so you can see the full me. You know, the front camera, it be reversed sometimes. I want you to see the full me right now. I'll be back. I did not charge my phone last night and we're about to have a content day. Oh my gosh, don't look at me. How do I look though? Okay. I know my eyes are dirty. I gotta wash my face. Um, Bailey, come here. <clears throat> Here's Bailey, my twin. Don't look at the customized. We're about to wash it. Bailey has a haircut appointment at one o'clock. Don't smell my breath. I have morning breath. <laughs> and it's like twelve thirty. So my thing. My thought process right now, you're so cute. You're so cute and wholesome. I just love you so much, Bailey. Oh my gosh. Um, what was I talking about? Ugh. Um, Bailey has a haircut appointment at one. It's 12.30 and while he's getting his haircut, I decided I'm gonna have a content day because I have content I need to get out. Are you still looking at the crust of my eyes? You're lucky I'm comfortable with you. Because if I wasn't, I would like, you know, be feeling uncomfortable. <laughs> but it's cool. You could look, I guess. You was going to do that anyway. Anyways, we're about to brush the teeth, clean the eyes. I'm really going to avoid washing my face because I did that last night. And we don't have time for that right now. Okay? Yeah, I think I want to get a tattoo today. What the fuck? Why the fuck do you want a tattoo, bitch? It's because, like, being a creator with no manager, that shit is, like, that shit is, like, sorry, just washing my hands. That shit is stressful. And sometimes I just need my mind off of everything. And when you're in pain, you don't really have time to think about anything else. So, I mean, I don't want to, like, mentally be in pain. So, I'm like, maybe I could just get a tattoo, get my mind off of the over overwhelming feelings that I've been having, and be happy. Temporarily. Um, <clears throat> I'm going to brush my teeth. I don't want you to watch me. So, I'll be back. I like that sound so much. When I blow my nose, I'll be wanting something crazy to happen. Just so I could be excited. But nothing happened. Oh my gosh, she washes her hands so much. I know, I'm sorry. What was I talking about again? Oh, I gotta stop doing that. Um, yeah, so... I was supposed to get my hair done Monday, which was yesterday, right? Because this sewing has been in my head for going on two months now. I'm not mad about it because, you know, it's really just a flex to me. But <laughs> she wanted to wait until she, like, got her fancy hair tools in or whatever. So my hair is still not done. This is what it looks like. And it's going to look like this for content day. And then I'll look like a cutie. Um, yeah, so like I said, content day. It's 50 degrees outside, so I can really go out there like this because I got to change in the car anyway. You won't know what I'm wearing. <laughs> that was so stupid. <laughs> Shut up. I don't know what I'm talking about. Let me go put some pants on. I'm going to put on my Pilates outfits because I'm going to Pilates today after content day. And then we might go get a tattoo. And we also have to go to the mall, so. Yeah. <laughs> my hand. I take a lot of mirror pictures and i think it would be really cool 
right there smack dab in the middle of the hand my hair needs to be washed but we don't have time for that <clears throat> so we're just gonna catfish it today make it look fresh even though that's damn near impossible now um i'm just talking is there anything you guys need to know sorry i'm looking at the wrong spot i don't really talk to y'all much like i really don't i just be <sighs> so out the loop i don't know what do you want me to say uh you know what no i'm not gonna tell y'all i'm i'm not gonna tell y'all um what the fuck kelsey wake up wake up oh my gosh i still feel like i'm asleep a little bit okay we're gonna do the clockwork because that's quick simple and fast and then we're gonna have to take this bra off and put on a baggy shirt because like i said i'm gonna be changing in the car i need quick fast and convenient right now i'm really stressed out <clears throat> you want to know why i'm stressed out so i don't even know if i can say this is this illegal i hope it's not illegal if i am saying this don't tell anyone that i'm saying this but as you guys know i have like these hoodies coming out they're called lover girl and um it's like a it's a it's a team it's not just me doing everything i kind of have the least work out of the whole entire team and when i was doing the the like promo videos of me just wearing lover girl i was like don't get this style like it sucks like it sucks so bad that i don't even want to wear it and what i mean by the style is the zipper because you know some companies they have zippers that are metal and then there's some that are plastic <sighs> just listen to me ramble if not skip to so and so which i'll put over here and I had like it was a mock hoodie so it was kind of just like a practice run right and I'm like okay since this is just a practice one it's okay I can make it look good and that's what I did that's what I did but I'm like as I was doing the content for it and shit I was like bro these hoodies fucking suck like the zippers are trash the hoodies are silver is okay but I just have beef with zippers. Like, you have to be a metal zipper to be a cool-ass hoodie to me. Yeah, so I'm like, as long as these shits is metal, we good. I was like, okay, do what you gotta do. I can't worry about it, so it's all in your hands. I have more stressful shit to tend to. I can't worry about Love It Girl. I'm here for it. Like, we're, I'm, we're a team or whatever, but that's not my top priority. So, you got it. And... I was out the loop with everything, bro. I'm like, what you mean to tell me these cities going to take six weeks to get shipped out? That's embarrassing. And then, <clears throat> like, people started DMing me because, again, we have a team. So, when y'all were, like, when people were to text the business page, it wouldn't be me responding. And I guess the person over that was not responding to y'all. So y'all started DMing, well not y'all, but I'm just going to use y'all as context. So people started DMing my main page like, hi, you're not responding to me. And I'm like, great. So now this is embarrassing, waiting six weeks. Now I look like a scammer because nobody's responding from the business page. I sound so congested. I'm sorry. And <clears throat> yeah, people were asking me about updates on their order and i'm like you know what you were so fucking right let me get an update on your fucking order so i'm like okay let me ask business partner and the team where the fucking updates are because i'm curious myself at this point and nobody like emailed emailed the customers hey y'all your order is in the making you'll see it so and so so and so like they were kind of just waiting for the customers to reach out to them which I personally, it upsets me. It really does because sometimes you could do stuff without having, never mind. Anyways, yeah. So I asked the team, I'm like, so where are the orders, y'all? Like, what's going on? And he's like, the manufacturer doesn't text me back. He hasn't texted me back. He's been ignoring me. And I'm like, what the fuck are you talking about? <sighs> Anyways, eventually the manufacturer texts back and he's like, oh yeah, here's a picture of your hoodie. That shit was the same hoodie I had in a plastic fucking zipper. So at that point, I was pissed off. Like, 
I work. I'm a creator. I'm my own manager. And I was in the middle of my Nike campaign. So I'm like, bro, I didn't ask to be in business right now. I didn't ask to do this, but I did it for us. And now somehow all the stress is on me. Because, you know, I am the face of Love Girl. And I'm not saying I'm running from any accountability because this is me. But it's just like, it's frustrating having multiple problems on you that I didn't want had on me in the first place, you know? <clears throat> So I, like, after he said that, I started looking for manufacturers myself. I was like, okay, we'll put out thousands of dollars. As long as this shit is done tomorrow, I don't give a fuck. This. And this is actually why I'm getting this fucking tattoo today. Because I am just going crazy. And then today, I, okay, so they didn't tell anybody anything, any updates. So I took it out my way to do it. <coughs> And I'm going to, like, I just feel bad about the whole process. I know it's a frustrating process or whatever. So I just ordered on Amazon a whole bunch of friendship bracelet kits. And I'm just going to sit there. I ship out the orders myself. So I'm going to sit there and I'm going to make all of us friendship bracelets or whatever. That's literally, like, 60 plus people. But I don't mind it. This is why I'm here with you right now. Because I'm just so stressed. And I just want to talk and ramble all day. And this is the only way I will with you. So, I'll be back. <laughs> we have a long day ahead of us. So, what I'm about to do now is put on my Pilates outfit or my Pilates pants and a big t shirt, and that's what we're gonna wear to content day. Here we are, headed out looking a mess, but it's okay. Bailey, let's go, Buka. Come on, how about this door? This is my content bag. Hey, look, it's a mess in here. I'm sorry. My life has just been all over the place, okay? I don't want Bailey to run away, but he's probably gonna run away. <clears throat> Stop. Bailey, come on, Buka, we late. Come on. Come on. Hop in the car, baby. <laughs> Go. You got this. Keep going. Come on. Come on. We late. There we go. He's so cute. Okay. We're late. Okay, let's go. How about that? I'll be back. Bye. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Self-control, baby. Hold on. Okay, we're running late. I had to park illegally really quickly. Sorry. I was recording in slow motion. Bendy's having no home training right now, as you can tell. He's so heavy. Holding him with one arm actually hurts. Did I sleep good last night? <sighs> okay, Bailey is dropped off, thankfully, because he was giving me the blues. Now I'm gonna run to a parking garage where I film my content. I have about an hour before he's ready. I'm not gonna lie, I thought bro was gonna tow the fuck out of my car because I was parked illegal, like extremely illegally. We are headed to a parking garage so we can start filming this content. What the fuck was going on there? <laughs> I'll talk to you later because I can't seem to get my words out right now. I'll be back when we make it to the garage, okay? Bye bye. We're here. This is my content spot. Um, it's freezing outside. I should have left the car on, but I'm not gonna do it. I'm gonna roll down the window though in case I lock myself out because that that be that happens sometimes. <laughs> I would do it right here, but I don't want the. Ooh, life's nice. Ooh, I can go right here, maybe. Ooh, this is cute, but. Oh, wait, wait, wait. What do you think? Is this cute or no? Like right here? Hi, hi. Whoa, boobies. 
comes in days over. Oh wait, this is pretty cool. I am so tired. I didn't even finish this outfit, but I I'm tired, boss. I'm freezing cold. I can't feel my hands and my nose is red. Bailey is ready for he's finished with his haircut. So I'm about to go get him. What is going on? My face. Did I stick that good? Let me know. Anyways, yeah. You're getting dressed now. This shirt and this logo looks amazing. Oh my gosh, why have I not worn this before? Have I worn this before? I don't think so, but I need to. Wow. <laughs> yeah, I'm not gonna find. I'm freezing cold, by the way. Did I mention that? Because I am. <sighs> I would go like this, but I actually look very funny. Hold on, let's see if I can shake it. <laughs> I'm not gonna do it though. Um, let's go. Cause I am in a, such a goofy mood. I wanna say, I mean, bro. <laughs> okay, maybe it's just my face. Maybe it's just my face. Maybe it's just me. Oh shit, I'm still in the dress. So tell me why, bro. I don't know. It's just either it's just super cold outside or something, but the wind is messing up my hair. I just am not comfortable because I'm trying to stay warm. Hold on, let's see how cold it is. Oh, sorry now. One sec. It's 50 degrees outside and there's no sun beaming on me. That's sunlight. That ain't sun beaming in that spot. So I'm just freezing cold. I'm uncomfortable. I can't do the content today. Who told me to be a, a content creator? Huh? They said, be a content creator because he is fun. That shit is not fucking fun. Not in the winter time. <laughs> I did like three outfits. We're going to see if I can put something together with that. If I cannot, then, um, then I'm going to redo the video not outside though i cannot i might just fly to mexico just to do this damn video at this point no i'm um, just kidding um yeah i'm about to go get bailey now i'll get back to you when he's here with us in the car which will be in about 40 seconds for you 10 minutes for me so brb we're headed to go get bailey i am going like this i know i know don't talk about me please I didn't have time to change, okay? Hi. Hey. <laughs> oh my goodness, yeah, baby. Yeah, you're with me. <laughs> Thank you. You look so cute. Um, sometimes you guys to see it through me. Big baby, not the little one. Tell him, quit playing with you. Fresh haircut, fresh bath. Oh, who y'all know? I can't be, I can't be not being humble because I look crazy. Hey, baby, you look good, Buka. Hey, he look good, okay? Tell him that I look good. Real handsome. Uh. <laughs> you can see me am i crooked i'm crooked 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 how did i look okay let's change come on <sighs> so i'm gonna wear this long sleeve today this long sleeve bodysuit from naked wardrobe with my yoga licious yoga pants um I know people. Oh, and then these are some Target grippy socks. I'll be right, right, right back. Just don't miss me too much. I have to pee. I'm sorry. We're not that close together yet, so I'll be back. And we're back with the Kelsey show. Now we're going to put on the yoga pants. These are literally the brand Yoga Licious. Extra small. Put a little bit of baby oil gel on my face because it's cold outside. I don't want my face to dry out. It's not, but you know, I love my clogs, my little Uggs, like so much. 
The red ones, I, they haven't grown on me yet because they still do give me clown vibes. How do I look? Ready for Pilates or what? I'm taking out the trash. I have this bad habit of when I'm running late or I have stuff to do, I have the urge to clean. So, I'm unhealthy. But I do have a heavy addiction to Gatorade. Gatorade is my kryptonite. best Gatorade pack I don't even like two out of the three but I'll settle for them just for that one and let me show you the best one this is the best one I can drink like five of these a day oh shit look see I just have them everywhere <laughs> I love Gatorade so much I'm taking all of these with me because I'm going to crave the Gatorade um, I think I'm going to get Chick-fil-A, just some fries or something small, because I don't like eating before class, and it's before class, so. I'm going to take this out. Oh, shit, Bailey, do you need water? Here we are in the car. Um, I'm going to slightly clean up a little bit, because, oh, yeah, Pilates starts in 30 minutes. So we finna head there, but I'm gonna multitask. Hold on. You wanna take a picture with me? Yes or no? Hi, hi. It's 3.23 and I just made it to Pilates class. Starts at 3.30. So we're about to go in there and chill. I am i don't feel comfortable recording in there. It's just you know, privacy and all of that, but I'll show you my outfit and beer bead. Okay, here we are. Clean Pilates outfit. Okay, bye. Hello? Any injuries, pregnancies, or modifications I should know about today? No. Okay, awesome. I feel like crap. I hate Pilates, but I love it. <sighs> Earlier today, I was talking about how sometimes pain makes me forget all the struggle that I'm going through. That's what Pilates does. Like, it's so intense that you have nothing else you can worry about. I like that. It's just not long enough for me. Um, my hand is shaking. <laughs> we did, like, arm workouts today, so I am a little quaky. Uh, we're about to head to the mall, the Galleria. We're in the Heights right now. Mm, that should be, like, 20 not even 20 minutes it should be close to around 20 minutes from where we are right now um the tattoo place that i want to go to closed at eight so we're gonna try to hurry up at the mall so we can hurry up and go back over here and do that okay i'm sorry i'm not making sense i'm at oh shit i have gatorade what the fuck been i have been drinking this yesterday but I, this is my favorite one, so I'm going to open this one and drink this one instead. It's so refreshing. I need to see what this lady looks like. Wow. My Pilates class is like rich rich old white women so it's so fascinating just seeing them do their every day like i don't know that shit's crazy this lady with this like custom g-wagon is parked next to me she has like the the fillers and the botox and all that. i'm like bro you live in your life i love that i don't like to do pilates with people like that because i feel like they be like judging the fuck out of me it's usually like old white rich women um so 
I like to do the classes with little to no people in it. I just feel like I'm not being judged because here I am, young 21 year old black woman in her Kia Forte. It's just, it's, it's a big difference, a big change. I wish more young black women came to Pilates. I think I've seen like two my whole time at Pilates and I've been to Pilates at least 20 times now. It's okay. I don't mind setting the example for the young black women. We got this, y'all. We're going to take over the world one day, for sure. We're going to head out to the gallo. I'm All right, we made it to the gallo. I didn't struggle for parking. I'm not even going to lie. This hole is packed, but I ain't struggle for parking, though, because... Hold on. I'm not... Oh, fuck. It was parked right there. What the fuck? I parked on a little corner. Okay, anyways, what was I talking about? Okay, y'all, so we're currently on Operation Find My Me. My mom, a birthday outfit, her birthday's tomorrow, and we're going to a fancy dinner, which we do every birthday occasion. Um, I hate doing this because she's so picky, and I dress like a whore, and she is married. So she likes to dress civilized. I really like this for her. This is really cute though. Does it give birthday? I think it gives birthday. I'm not one to talk about people, but that's actually crazy to me. Like, the fingers are open. But. Ooh, I like this. Okay, okay. Hold on. We're, we're getting some. This is when we're getting her. She didn't want to look like a birthday girl, so we're gonna do this. And we're gonna give her some cute fuzzy socks, and she's gonna wear some Louis Vuitton boots. Okay, we're out of there. We're about to go to Victoria's Secret. I look so funny. <laughs> we're about to go to Victoria's Secret for some fuzzy socks because this lady is obsessed with fuzzy socks. I don't think she understands birthday category. You can see herself in my glasses. Hmm. Found um, fuzzy socks, holy girl. I'm gonna give her these two black and pink. If I'm being honest, nothing against pink, but I absolutely hate this store. Like, it's reached its peak already. These are oh my gosh, these are so cute. I hate that store and you've seen that receipt it's probably like that whole do not hate that store but I do I'm going to Kane's now because I'm so hungry and then we're gonna go see about this tattoo because I'm seriously going to get a tattoo today I don't know if I'm in the right state of mind to choose the right tattoo or not Now. I'm trying to keep my composure on the inside. I'm screaming because it's so freaking cold. I wish I would have parked right there now. Like, all jokes to the left of me. Right here? Is this a bad idea? It might be a bad idea. It might be, but I just, I, I need to. I have to. Let's go see how much they're going to charge me. And okay, so they're all booked up. They, I'm gonna, that might have been my sign not to get a tattoo, but I'm still gonna try. We're gonna go to a warmer place. They don't close, this place closes at eight. The next place closes at two and I called them. So we're gonna go and see what they're talking about. And um, my seatbelt's not on, sorry. Don't look at my bad driving habits. Um. What was I saying? Yeah, we're gonna go see what they're talking about and if they can do the tattoo for me. Cause I went the wrong way. Okay. 
We're gonna see if they can do my tattoo or at least how much they'll charge me for it. And if they can do it, hopefully they're really good. I'm gonna have to see their work before I establish if I'm gonna let them do it or not. But if they are, then I'll just get it today. I guess. I'm still kind of iffy. I know I want the tattoo on my hand now, but I'm just getting antsy. I guess now that I know that I'm about to attempt to get the tattoo on my hand now. Um, I'll just let you know when we get there. We're here at the second place. Let's see what they're talking about. I'm about to get a tattoo and um, I already signed all the, the papers and stuff. Uh, I'm, I don't know how to feel. This, I do want a tattoo. I do want a tattoo, but it's just now that it's happening, I don't know how I feel. No, okay, I wanted a tattoo of something very meaningful to me, but I don't really do meaningful tattoos, so I just chose something silly, and it's gonna be on my hand right here. It's very minimal, which I love. Um, I'm gonna just take you on this journey with me. We're about to get a tattoo, so ye whoa no I'm sorry. Protein balls. I'm in pain. I'm in pain. I'm in pain. I'm in pain. It's not a bad pain, but it is pain. Um, that took like five minutes. I'm also really cold, so don't think I'm just crying. Oh my God, I got a tattoo on my hand. <laughs> the fuck? Okay, it's out the way, it's done. I need to prop you up, huh? Hold on. Ouch. We're done, we finished the tattoo. That took five minutes. We're done. It's out the way. Okay. Oh, just breathe. Just breathe. Just breathe. You just got a tattoo on your hand. And my hand is fucking bleeding. And this shit is throbbing. And it hurts so fucking bad. Whew, breathe. Okay. Good. We're done. I took that shit like, you know, a bad bitch. The bad bitch that I know I am. I did that um I can't even act like I'm not in pain because I am in pain and while doing the whole needle process shit I wasn't even like you know the whole reason I got the tattoo was the pain and to get my mind off of shit and now that I have the pain I'm okay I am crying about the pain but I'd rather be crying about the pain than crying about my problems but it's done definitely done um here it is did we have a good day together i hope we did <sighs> how do i feel i don't know how i feel right now i don't know how i feel he was going so fast like i didn't have time to think like fuck slow down okay it's done we already got the shit it's no going back now I'm starting to gain feeling back in my hand again talking to you. So thank you for this therapy session right now. Uh, how do you feel? I didn't ask you how you feel. I already told you how I feel. So now I need to know how you feel. See if you're on the same page, if you're okay. Also, um, also, uh, do stuff by yourself i've spent this whole day by myself and with you and um if i can do it you can do it ah my hand hurts <sighs> back to what i was saying if a lot of you guys are always like kelsey how do you just do spontaneous shit by yourself like take trips or go shopping or go to fucking games and get tattoos and shit like that and it's really just to build up you know other people's company is cool and fine but at the end of the day 
you are all you have and you are the only person that's going to 100% understand you and get you 100%. So you have to appreciate yourself. I know that it might be awkward doing stuff like that by yourself, but it's really just you enjoying your own company. And um, I had been like, um, I have friends. Don't think I don't have friends. They just, they're in school or they're always at work. So I don't want to have fake friends that I just spend time with. So I kind of just enjoyed my own company. And since I have been single for so long, relationships and dating and all that, that's not really like a necessity to me. I know some people crave like male attention or they crave like the going out on dates and stuff like that. That's not me. It probably, I probably had to build up to that, but I, I don't really crave that anymore. So I am 100% okay and comfortable being by myself now. I'm not saying that it'll come easy, but it does take time. And when you do realize that you are your best friend, you will absolutely love doing everything by yourself. Trust and believe me. The first time I got a tattoo, I did it with best friends. And the second time I was like, bro, I need to get one by myself. Like everything that I could do with people, I need to also learn how to do by myself. Now we're here in pain, but I did it by myself. So cheers to us, right? Um, I'll be back. I'll see you in a little bit. I'm sorry. <laughs> My hand is being weird. I'll see you in a little bit, okay? Bye. Yeah, we made it home. I was supposed to go to Walmart for some healing shit, but I have to keep this on for the next 24 hours, so I'm okay for today. And I don't like Walmart, so I'm avoiding going to Walmart. After work tomorrow, I might go to Target because I'm turning into a Target girly, for real. It is nice. Hi. You look so cute. Yeah. You want me to pick you up? And we're back with the Kelsey Show. I am home now, and we're almost coming to the end of our day together. How do you feel? It's a bittersweet moment. I miss these little spending day with each other videos wow my hand is still in pain um a lot of pain this is my new permanent tattoo for the rest of my life i love it <laughs> i am in pain though so i can't express how i feel right now um it's a good pain though this tattoo was needed shout out to y'all for getting this with me um, let's get ready to hop in the shower. Yeah, my hand is in pain. I can't even hide it anymore. A little bit. I'm gonna take a shower. I'll see you when I get out the shower. Bye. Okay, post shower. Okay. We're about to have din din together. What's for dinner? Gatorade. My other one is in the car. The other two are gone. So we're opening our fourth Gatorade of the day. Or third, I don't know. <sighs> oh my gosh. This right here, it just, this is the, the my least favorite flavor. I don't really like this flavor because it's just too too watery. They don't have much flavor. Glacier Freeze. Don't get me wrong, it's not bad. It's just not. It's the least favorite out of the pack. <sighs> Still good though. We're eating waffles for dinner. This is just, they're everywhere. What can I say? You mean editing? Are you waffles? Fun fact. You're not supposed to eat standing up because you don't get full. 
And if you don't get full, you keep eating. You keep eating, you gain weight. Don't be like me. Our night is slowly coming to an end. Are you sad about it? Also, I feel like waffles like this, home waffles, need to be eaten with your hands. You cannot eat a waffle with a fork. Not these type of waffles. <clears throat> That's what pancakes are for. Muffles, finger food. Look at your fresh haircut. You look so handsome. I don't know if I've mentioned it before, but he likes his butt rub because he's an independent man and he can scratch every part on his body besides his butt. He can scratch every part of his body besides his butt. So every time he can find someone that'll willingly scratch him, he's gonna go for the butt every time. Isn't he giving cat vibes? Or just the big grizzly bear vibes. I'm folding clothes. If I don't get to say my goodbyes, I'm going to tell them now. I'm going to say them now. I will give them now. How do I say that? Which one was the right one? I'm going to give them now. I think it's I'm going to give them now. I'm going to miss you. I hope that you learned a thing or two from me today. And I hope you enjoyed our time together. I can't wait to see you again. Oh my gosh. I have fun with you today. Even though we did freeze to death. And we did die in Pilates. I don't know what else we did that was traumatizing to me or you. We did a lot. And I'm glad we had a nice productive Tuesday together. I can't wait to see you again. Um. Bye.